Hi, I'm Reverend Tom Kearns. I'd like to welcome you to 333 Magic 9, your astrology channel. I am here at the beautiful Grafton Peace Pagoda and we'll be celebrating the Buddha's birthday in May and we'll be praying for peace in the world. And May starts with a new moon in Taurus. Then Mars goes direct finally in Libra and that should help settle things down. And then there's a wonderful aspect between Venus and Uranus, which can add a lot of spice to life. Now here's what all that means for you. The month begins under the Taurus New Moon. Pisces, the Taurus New Moon in your third house of travel and communications increases your imagination and brings a sense of wanderlust. Your awareness is open to new ideas and is easily affected by experiences. So keep your mind and your emotions clear. This is a good time to write, to study, or travel because real life can help improve your knowledge base. Keep clear, be practical, but take time out for a romantic adventure. Mars goes direct in Libra. Pisces, Mars moves forward in your eighth house of shared resources, rebirth, and renewal. This energy stimulates your intuition and your sensuality. So listen carefully to your feelings about other people. Business or financial dealings may come to a good conclusion at this time. Just remember to negotiate fairly and check all the details. This is a good time for you to purge bad habit patterns control and purify your desires and you'll feel a sense of renewal. Before going on to the rest of the month's predictions, here's an idea that can help you for an entire year. You can order a personalized transit chart for the next 12 months or a psychic and spiritual reading by phone. Just go to my website, professorastrology.com and be prepared for 2014. Venus conjuncts Uranus. Pisces, you'll love the sense of excitement as Venus joins Uranus in your second house. Now normally, Venus brings a sense of luxury, satisfaction, and extravagance as she transits through the second house. You want to enjoy everything that money can buy. However, when Uranus joins this loving planet, Money can come and go quickly. <laughs> you need to count your change and watch your spending. You need to know what is important to you and maintain some common sense when it comes to money. Do not gamble on a whim. But savvy investors should keep an eye on the most promising of the newest technology stocks. Creative talents can produce tangible returns. Now these predictions were just based on your sun sign, not on your own particular chart. If you'd like to get predictions based on your time, date, and place of birth, then go to my website, professorastrology.com, and go to the Psychic and Spiritual Readings page. There you'll find a way where you can order either a transit chart for the next 12 months or a personal Psychic and Spiritual Reading for you. Now, I'd like to thank you for watching. I'd like to ask you to subscribe to these videos because they're free. And please share them with your friends. They'll love them because they'll help them. Again, thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. And I hope you have a great month.